Hello there and welcome to my workshop and today we're going to do a video with the SMC5 controller. We're going to connect up a touch plate or zero, zero plate to it and get it working and I'll show you how to switch it all on, connect it all up and how to work out the parameters and how to alter the parameters in the controller itself which is quite easy actually and uh, we'll get it all working all right so the first thing I'm going to show you is where everything is so we open up machine scroll I'm just using the big scroll wheel over here Okay, inputs. Go to inputs. Here, probe. Okay. Um, so the probe pin that we're interested in the back is probe nine. Okay, so that's telling us where to connect it into. Um, so here we need to actually turn it on as well. So we'll do that now. So we change that zero, so just push that, change that zero to a one. Come out of that. Save. So now the probe circuit is turned on. Now just, let's come out of that. Now just to make sure it is, I've got the probe connected up, but I'm just going to touch the earth on it okay so you see here on on nine okay so the controller sees it and it's working so next thing we're going to do is have a look at the connections on the back so we're looking in the back of the controller and we can see pin number nine is there which is the fifth one down and the second across so you can see second across fifth one down I'm connected into that. Um, now what I've done is I've chose this earth over here and I've connected it into there. There are three or four different earths on here, it's just I connected it. This one is out of the way. Obviously all the earths are connected up together. So it's the only things that you have to connect into in the back. So we'll move on. Right, so the next thing we need to do is to set up the probe parameters. So you go to machine, scroll, ah, let me see, controller. Here we are. Probe height and rebound. Okay, so now our probe is 10 millimeters. Press enter and we need it to rebound or come back off, off, off the material eight millimeters to clear our ledge on our corner finder so that's it down to save and that's all you need to do let me just check the speed Here it is. Okay. Probe speed. This is where we need to go. So I think uh, probably uh, start off at 100. That's uh, millimeters per minute, I would say, from memory. I'm not going to be okay with that. C. 
save. Okay, so we have... I think we've completed everything there we need to. Okay, let's see if it works. And when you get all the parameters right in your SMC5, it should work something like this. So there you are. It's uh, quite easy, really. Uh, just several places in the controller that you need to change the zeros to one uh, to enable. And of course, you've got to fill in um, how or the height of your touch plate or your puck, whatever you use, and also the standoff that you require further up. Mine's quite high because I've got a, a lip. Let's just unplug it. Yeah. Yeah, this is uh, 12 mil, and this is lip is 6 mil. That's 12 mil. This is 6 mil. So uh, you know, I've got a fair height to come up off to be able to sort of pull this out. But um, it's really very similar, if not the same, as Mac 3 to set up for a probe. Um, you just need to connect into the, the correct uh, area in the back. It's only two wires, a positive and a negative. You just need an earth. And it's just the terminal that's displayed inside the controller here. Um, when you go to machine, you go to uh, inputs and you change it there. And the, the, the actual terminal or pin number is displayed there, which you connected in and you just change the, then the, to enable it, you change the zero to a one. And it's as simple as that. And um, the controller will do the rest for you. And, you know, I've made a couple of videos now um, showing my disgust of the sellers in China I'm trying to sell this for like $1,200. This is worth about $500 only. And at that price, it's a really, really good controller. And if you can, and, and I've checked even today, uh, that uh, there are a couple of sellers that are playing the game and they are still selling it at around about $500 mark. Uh, they might put a bit of freight on that as well. But, um, and you know, for $500, I got mine with a controller as well. With a, you know, the, oops, my little controller as well, you know, for all for, $500 shipped to my door but that was like uh, 18 months to two years ago now so you know prices have pushed up by now but uh, so you should be able to get this for around about $500 still and they may charge a, a bit of freight on that and they may charge extra now for the, the can, hand controller so it may after two years and COVID and everything else in between uh, may have gone up to about maybe $600, but I wouldn't be paying any more. But, you know, for that sort of money, it's a damn good little controller. Okay then, so that's how to set the touch probe up in the uh, SMC. And uh, I hope you've enjoyed the video today. If you have, please press like and subscribe. And... If you really like what I'm doing, you could consider becoming a patron to my channel because it is the patrons behind the channel that allow me to, you know, do things like this, to be able to, you know, sort of buy a controller or everything to make a, this is the, the MIDI actually, uh, that I built two and a half years ago, possibly three years ago now, and there's about uh, 12, I think about 12 videos on actually how to make this and um, you know how to make every part of it and you can make it for 
around about well, at the time of making the, the, the making this myself uh, with the controller, I think the total bill was about I was trying to get it for under a thousand dollars, but it was about it was around about a thousand dollars. I mean, uh, you know, I don't buy um, you know I don't buy second-rate stuff. You know, I use Stepper online for you know motors and that and. I get the best screws that I can, um, and you know everything for a, for a price. It's uh, I get the best that I can, and well, there you are. This is now probably about um, twelve hundred dollars worth, if just just the sum of the parts, you know. Okay then. So, thank you for watching the video, and it's bye for now. Oh,